Hey everybody, I wanna show you a really great feature of PlayPosit that you may not have heard of before. It's called Broadcast. Broadcast allows you to do a live PlayPosit bulb with students where you are showing the video and the students are not receiving the link to the video. So that would definitely allow, um, allow this to happen under our new YouTube policy. So check out how this works. It starts out pretty much the same as any other PlayPosit bulb in Schoology. What you wanna do is come up here and add materials and choose external link, external tool. So uh, external tool, and then we want to drop down menu to play pause it, give it a name. Uh, this one's gonna be how to draw a face. And then we just give it, uh, we check the box for enable grading. Uh, let's say it's a 10 point play pause bulb, whatever the point value is for your play pause bulb is what you wanna put in here. Give it a due date, let's make it due at the end of the week classwork and um, uh, we can do, uh, I'll just use this for the grading period since this is just a staff development training uh, course, hit submit. And just like before, it doesn't look like anything has happened. So remember we need to click on the link, which then takes us to this embedded version of PlayPosit so that we can set the bulb link. So we click on that and we go over to our My Bulb section. And let's scroll down here to, okay, so here we're gonna do facial proportions, how to draw a face. So I click on the Schoology logo, click on that. And normally we would select uh, self-paste because we would be giving the link to the students and they would work through the bulb at their own pace. But no, not, not this time. We are going to click this and choose live broadcast because we are doing this synchronously. So we are going to click on the blue link button and it says that we are now linked. And in order to start the broadcast, let me just back out. So when you're ready, you just click on the link again. Again, we will see the inside of PlayPosit, but now we've got the button over here that says broadcast. It opens up in a new tab and there's a green start button over here. We just click on start. And the first question the students are gonna be presented is how confident are you in your ability to draw a face? So let's look at it from the student point of view. So over here, we've got a student uh, account when uh, let's see, let me reload this. So over here we have a student account and they click on how to draw a face. And just like in the teacher version and in before, they uh, get a window that has the first question. So let's just say uh, it's not confident yet. And they click on submit. So over here on the teacher side, I can see oh, there's been one's response. Um, and there is the response from one student. If they wanted to show the names, you can see the names of the students who responded. So the next thing we want to do is begin playing the video. Welcome back to another video tutorial. Now notice that even though the video is playing in the teachers, it is not playing for the student. So the student does have to watch your video play in Google Meet. So the next question in this video is not for about another minute. So I'll just let it play uh, and I'll fast forward to that point. Okay, so the video is paused. So over here on the um, student side, you can see the next question has already been displayed. And over here, the eye line is located in the forehead, the middle of the head, the top of the head. And uh, we just click on the middle of the head and the student clicks on submit. They get the feedback that that is correct. Again, I can show responses, can show the names if I want. And so then you as the teacher would just continue going through the bulb and it will pause the questions and the students will then um, look at the questions here. Uh, let's fast forward and once the bulb is done, we'll take a look at the grade book. Okay, and when the video is done, you just click on the finish and exit button and leave. And then you can return to your course and you can see how the students did by going over to the grade book area. And you can see here's the how to draw a face assignment and there were 10 points earned for 100%. So that's how the broadcast feature works in PlayPosit. I hope you find this useful and let me know if you have any questions about getting started.